everyone. My name is Le Thi Van Gui. I am 11 years old and currently learning in Newton Grammar School. With the rise of climate change, Earth is slowly becoming, becoming inhabitable. Scientists are constantly looking for a plan to replace Earth as our new home. Mars is one of them. Mars is the closest planet with an atmosphere, water, and life. Many people think we should colonize Mars and live there. I am not one of them. Here are a few reasons why. My first reason is that it's really expensive. The money alone to hire an astronaut for one hour is $130,000 per hour. And that is just for one hour. And that is a staggering sum. Imagine hiring them for one day. You have to be a millionaire to be able to do that. And that is not to mention the price of making a spaceship and spacesuits. And after even if we already landed somewhere on Mars, we also need to create the equipment for people to be able to live there, like oxygen providers and also cars and lots of stuff. We also need a lot of spaceships to, to transport food from Earth all the way up to Mars. And now for my second reason. My second reason is that it takes a lot of time. Even if we are able to send someone on Mars, it still takes a lot of time. But we haven't even sent anyone on Mars yet. Scientists have only sent rovers there to explore, but no one has ever been in there. So how are we supposed to colonize it, even if we're able to, to buy a spaceship and a spacesuit for astronauts to get up there, it will take years, millions of years, just to create a family, a government, and colonize it into an actual home. And my third and final reason is that it's dangerous. Mars atmosphere is really different from Earth's atmosphere. 96% of Mars' atmosphere is carbon dioxide, which is really bad for us humans. Also, there is barely any oxygen on Mars. Only one-tenth of one percent of Mars' atmosphere is just, is just oxygen, and that is barely even enough for us humans to survive. Also, one of the most dangerous things about Mars is that it has radiation. Space radiation is naked to the human eye, so it's really hard imagining it, but it's, all, it's very dangerous. So, if you want to live on there, you need to make spacesuits that prevent radiation. Also, another thing is that Mars, Mars' atmosphere is much, much, much further than Earth's atmosphere, which means if an unprotected visitor visits Mars, then their blood will literally boil, and that is really dangerous. So, if living on Mars is really that difficult, is there a better alternative? Well, there is, actually. It's much easier and cheaper than spending a lot of money just to go to Mars. It is reduced pollution. If you don't want to spend that much money just on hiring astronauts and then, and then buying a spacesuit and then buying a spaceship and then getting there and all sorts of crazy stuff, then all you need to do is reduce pollution. It's really simple, actually. Everyone can do it. Even I can do it. So, Reducing pollution is just as simple as turning off the tab when you don't need it or turn off the lights when you don't need it because if you actually don't turn off the lights, then a fire could start. I experienced one before and it was very, very scary. Also, you, you could reduce the use of plastic. One use plastic, example, nylon bags are usually used to buy groceries. You can use fabric bags which are much more stable, fashionable, and also good for the environment. Also, another way is to reduce greenhouse gases, reduce the use of factories, and instead try to make, try to reduce it and make sure that we don't have the greenhouse effect, which affects our, the ozone level and which creates, which makes Earth uninhabitable. So thank you for listening and goodbye.